All right, defensive backs, linebackers, anyone in coverage. Today's tip is one that coaches are not allowed to tell you anymore in this game, this day and age of football. We're looking at how to out physical receivers. This is a great rep by Jair Alexander. The best part is not the gritty after mocking Justin Jefferson, which he strapped up. The best part is how he out physicals Jefferson. You can see here, Jair, he gets a pass defense. He already got the ball down. He know there's no way Jefferson's gonna make this catch. But what does he do next? He throws his body weight onto Jefferson. He's looking at the ball. He sees the play is done. Look what he does next. Throws his body weight onto Jefferson. The goal is not to hurt the receiver, but it's to let him know that we're gonna be there and it's gonna be a long day. Football, four quarters, 60 minutes. You get a lot of plays. He might have 60 snaps that you're playing on defense. So you have to know, you have to let the receiver know <laughs> It's going to be a long day. Football is both a mental and a physical game. Remember, receivers, why do they play receiver? They're good athletes. They can catch, sure. But they don't like contact. For the most part, they don't like contact too much. They don't want to be tackled. They don't want to get hit. So if you can't consistently make a play while or before you throw your body onto a receiver, making him feel it, tackling him hard, um, you know, tackling, playing through the whistle, not letting up. Now, obviously, playing within the rules, don't do anything illegal or get any flags, but just take the physical game to him for the full 60 minutes. If you can do all of this, you're going to get in the receiver's head. They like when it's one-on-ones, playing in the, you know, the summer, running routes, when nothing hurts, they feel good, and they can move their fastest. So if you are constantly taking the battle to the receiver, out physicaling them, landing them, landing on them every chance you get, I promise you, it's going to do something mentally to them and physically they're going to feel worn out and that they can't play their best football. So this is a tip how to out physical receivers. There are other ones which I can post later. Let me know in the comments what you'd like to see, but use this tip and use it at your own discretion. Do not get any flags or piss off your coaches and tell them that Pick 6 Athletics told you to do this. I'm just saying, when it's within the rules, land on the receiver and it will do a great deal making it a mental and physical battle for 60 minutes.